The presentation is an update on um, where we are today in uh, autoimmune hemolytic anemias. Warm autoimmune hemolytic anemia accounts for about 80% of all of the autoimmune hemolytic anemias we see in our hematology patients. It's mediated by an IgG autoantibody. Cold is much less common, accounting for about 15 to 18% of all of the autoimmune hemolytic anemias we see. And it's mediated by an IgM autoantibody that subsequently, once it binds to the antigen on the surface of the red blood cell, activates the classical pathway of complement. And it's actually complement deposition, not the antibody itself that is responsible for hemolysis in cold as opposed to warm, where it is the antibody deposition on the surface of the red cells that's responsible for the hemolysis.